Go ahead and grab your strap. Keep the block there. Ooh. And then hold the strap overhead at about shoulder width distant. I'm going to turn to face you so you can see this. So I want you to turn the toes to face straight forward. Make sure the insides of your feet are still parallel. And then squeeze the strap up directly overhead. As you inhale, get tall. Reach your arms up. And then as you exhale, lean into a side bend. So I want you to continue to squeeze the strap. Pull it in opposite directions. As you inhale, push the top of your head up. As you exhale, kind of lean a little bit more toward the right. But we're staying tall here. I don't want you to collapse into the right side. Don't turn your left shoulder to face down. Keep your torso facing out. And then bring it back to the middle. Go ahead and switch sides, reaching over to the left. Continuing to push down through your feet, squeezing your thighs, keeping your core and your hips active. Inhale, get tall. Exhale, lean a little bit more toward your left. You're going to feel like stretching in the entire right side of your body and your core and your hips are going to be working as well. Bring it back to the middle into a standing back bend. So I want you to push down through your feet. Focus on bending from the mid back up. So keep your butt under your torso and then squeeze your arms back as far as possible. Look just slightly up. Even this is a back bend. So no matter how shallow it is, this is a back bend. So again, the arms are squeezing back. The top of your head is lifting away from your shoulders and we're squeezing the thighs to help protect the spine. Make sure that your butt isn't coming up behind you. Make sure you're not arching the back, but again, kind of reaching the tailbone down, lengthening the lower back and squeezing the block between your thighs. One more breath here. and then go ahead and release.